What's up, everybody? Do a quick garden update. I'm going to show you around a little bit, show you things I got planned, and what we're going to do moving forward. So, here we have the what's essentially going to be uh, the in ground part of our fall garden. Uh, this is just something to get back in the habit of gardening again. But uh, there'll be a trellis back there for snap peas. Um, haven't quite decided exactly what we're going to put in here. Um, but uh, I'll show you those all the different plants we have here in just a second. And this half here will also be included. Uh, but I'm going to work on this for the spring uh, over the winter. So this will all be uh, part of the spring garden. But for now, just this. Uh, back here, uh, this used to be an old billy goat pen. Um, but uh, we use this as our garden shed. Uh, not everything's in here right now. i got stuff pulled out. But... Uh, uh, this whole area right here, uh, we're going to pull up all the uh, croton and then mow everything else down. And uh, I'm going to plant a watermelon in here for the fall um, and then for the spring and early summer garden next year, we'll have watermelon and cantaloupe in here. We may even put uh, the squash and the cucumber in, cucumber in here, uh, but for now... Uh, I've already got watermelon planted in pots, and that's what's going to go back here for the fall. Uh, over here we have two boxes. This is uh, box one, box two. But uh, this box, this is all cucumber. Um, these seeds amazingly sprouted within one day. Uh, they had to get in quick, so I put them in this box here. Uh, this box has... Uh, old animal bedding mixed with manure uh, down in the bottom and then I used Kellogg uh, brand uh, organic garden soil from Home Depot uh, it was like 72 some odd dollars just for 16 cubic feet uh, in this one and in box two uh, we have the same uh, animal bedding mix them newer at the bottom then we have uh, native soil which is a sandy loam that I took out of the fall garden spot over there and uh, uh, then topped off with Silver Creek materials uh, bulk premium garden soil and in here um, we originally had uh, some cabbage over here which I didn't think would survive and they clearly did not so I replaced them with jalapeno, however it appears that uh, one, two, three of the four jalapeno have uh, deceased and that one's not looking too good. Uh, the high temps here in Texas, 108 plus degrees, uh, it's not doing so good. We have three squash right here, uh, yellow uh, straight neck, and then we have, what the hell did we plant over here? Um, okra we got uh, okra over here and the okra doing okay okra love the heat so uh, we'll keep you updated